Throw it off of the ground tonight The way you look at me just like I'm yours Yeah I never felt like this before You make me feel the way I ain't feel in a minute I feel like I'm living when I'm looking at you, baby Never felt like this before You gave me butterflies in my tummy like you do You just give me love like I can only get from you, yeah. This is the Dahmer show Oh, oh I know, God. huh? So fucking crazy Are you guys ready? Jalen, show them your little OOTD that I dressed you today Look at how cute you look Ah, My little TikToker Um, we're ready Let's go, Thank ladies yeah. Birthday girl. Close the door. When you close it, turn off the. I mean, put your your palm on the thing so you can lock. Oh, okay. Bye, babe. Bye. Is there anybody else in the room? No, I don't think so. So we're going to dinner. We're going to dinner for my sister's birthday. And the Uber. And the Uber is outside. <laughs> Oh my god. Careful! Me guardo el cico yo. Me guardo el cico yo. Agárrame porque. Ay, yeah. And we got a limo for the princess. Hello. Blanca. Blanca. Happy birthday, sister. Thank you. Oh my god, the lighting looks so good. Look. Not just the Bieber being the one that comes over. Marina came with the drink. Yes. Let me admire my sister, 40. Ooh, yes. You're going to be our little bartender? Hi, ladies. Hey, you guys ready for this or what? Yes. Yeah. Just got to the restaurant. <laughs> the lights in the back look so pretty. So we're drinking. I mean, we're at the restaurant, but I want you guys to admire how pretty my nails look. Can you make it a? And they're natural. It's the only nat thing natural in my life. It's only a gross thing. Look how pretty they look. Cheers, Saturday. Cheers, sister, to water. Can you guys believe my sister's turning 40 years old and she looks, I look older than her. Like, like how has she maintained herself so young and beautiful? She's natural and I'm a big bitch. I don't think it was ugly. <laughs> I didn't say it was ugly, I said I was old. <laughs> you don't look old. I feel like I feel like I'm keeping young because you're keeping old. We look like twins right now with the makeup look. Is it really bad? And then guys, uh, Jalen is gonna be my my me to her, and she's gonna keep me young. My little baby. Little baby girl. My first daughter. Dude, I told Vin. When she, no, I asked her when is it, when you turn when she turns 21, how old are you gonna be? She's like 47, and I'm like, fuck. I was like, well, good thing you're not like with a 21 year old right now, because I feel like that would make me feel more old. Yeah. Like, damn, my daughter's already 21, partying. Yeah, you guys wanna? She's over here gonna be like. So I got a vodka pasta guys, which is my favorite. Viv got margarita pizza. She's a craving pizza. That's all she wanted for her birthday. <laughs> and then Ashley got pasta. Pasta. Everybody got pasta over here. I just got <laughs> and then I didn't record, but I should have recorded. We were telling Viv what we love about her, and I made her cry. Oh no! Because I love her. Quiere llorar, quiere llorar, quiere llorar. <laughs> Jalen, <laughs> Jalen, when your mommy cries, why does she cry? Because of me, I'm the only one that can make her cry. It's because she loves me so much. I'm her favorite. <laughs> She's like, f me. I'm Ready? Yes, let's go, birthday girl. Okay, that you, that wasn't even half. That's, this is what 40 looks like. Oh my god. Show them how it's done. And then 
Enseñale. La 20, la 24 year old, enseñale. Huh? Get it, get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. I can't see from far. Yeah, yeah you look beautiful. Can I, can <laughs> look I, can I? I can't see from far. <laughs> Telemasu. That's not tiramisu, it's regular cake. JJ, you want ice cream? Oh, yeah. Mmm. Good. Mmm. <laughs> don't say ice cream in front of Jay. Guys, Guys, don't say it. I have an announcement. Nice. Open your mouth. I'm like, what? I'm like trying to. She can take it little bites like this. No, and I'm like, Jay, then open your whole mouth. That is so good. I'm so tasty. What is that? Good. Like sponge cake? Yeah. She says she's pregnant. Nobody <laughs> cake? Mm. Like lemon cake. Yeah. Is it ice cream? Yeah, it's really good. Yeah, it's so small. It's like so vanilla bean. Guys, I don't know. Guys, I have an announcement too. I'm just blowing it. Okay. It's just pregnant and we're drinking. Pull up this. You have a lipstick right here. Right here. Oh. <laughs> No. Well, if you have a boyfriend, we might. Don't tell us you're pregnant. <laughs> no, but at least like a guy in her life. At least another human being. At least another human being somewhere. Oh shit! I'm so. <laughs> you fucking exposed my whole ass life. <laughs> you exposed me. I, it's okay, that's so rude. Hey, last two favorite sister in laws. My sister in law in her speech said that Viv was her favorite sister in law. She is. She is. <laughs> I love my sister in law. Who is it? I love you too, Tony. Oh my god. So, are we just gonna pretend that I'm not here? Huh? Are we gonna pretend that I'm not here? No, but you said you love her. Like, she's your favorite. She's my favorite, but I love you. <laughs> too. <laughs> Well, good thing Vicky's my favorite sister-in-law. Bye. Vicky's my favorite sister-in-law because she actually makes me huevos con weenies. And they're good. Really? Really? Do you remember when you Tortillas? Los huevos con tortilla? Who experimented on whose hair? Oh, I know. Well, because you didn't want to go pay to get highlights. What? I, she used to beg me. Come on, let me do highlights. Let me do this. Yo. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Just walk right here. Zam Zaylin. Look at your outfit. I dressed her. Did I tell you guys that I dressed her, guys? And she looks so cute. This is my clothes, my top, my bottom, my shoes. Let's <laughs> find out. Thank you for joining us to celebrate my beautiful sister and you, her sister. turning the Let's big four O. Did I mention that she's turning 4-0? Did I mention she mentioned 40? Yeah, more like 3-0. Did I mention that my sister Shut up. is turning 40? Because <laughs> I'm having a hard time believing it. Jessica, what did I say? Jessica Parker? She, Jessica no, Rabbit? she's she's like the, the Book of Eli. Oh, no, not Book of Eli. The, <laughs> the uh, Benjamin Button. <laughs> she's <laughs> aging backwards. <laughs> Viv, like younger, younger every day. Oh, God. Viv, what are you doing? Are you are you sucking children's lives like the Hocus Pocus Ew. girls? I am. Are you keeping like yourself young by making potions? Sure <laughs> like <I am>. a billionaire? <laughs> well, are you in that club in the island Well, my with, fucking uh, body Jeffrey doesn't Steve? feel like I'm... Yeah. I feel like I'm 45. <laughs> uh, Careful with the kids.
Dice que para el hombre es que no me pegue. ¿Es ice cream? No. <laughs> Compré mi There. Uh, I always do the first cut and then the next one. Oreo. Oh, I cut it here. I don't want any. I'll wash your hands first. Um, okay, you get this there? My what? You get... No. Oh, For me? For you? Sister, you already got me. Pay you already paid for everything for dinner and everything, and then you're still giving me a, great, a gift? Oh yeah, I'm very, I'm grateful. I'm sorry. I love it. Thank you, sister. I haven't even opened it. I thought I was going to say anything. You know when you have a dog and then you get used to your dog's mouth? You get used to your dog's mouth. Wow. Wow. No, but even me, what do we have when you stop? You know like there's dog owners that think like they, their house doesn't smell, but they really like do smell. smell. They don't because I've had yeah. people come over yeah. and they say it doesn't. Why does it smell in your house? Huh? Does Thank you, Jay. Jay's been to my house and she said it doesn't. Oh, no, I don't know. I forget. No, I'm not in your house. No, 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 but I'm, right no, but I'm saying like, I don't feel like my house. Uh, there's like a natural dog smell, man. Yeah. yeah. That's what dog smell like. You smelled it? Yeah, she smelled like a dog. But if you like fix the camera, because Oh my god. It's kind of this you can get a pedazo de pizza. Digo, de pizza. Wow! Look at the pizza. 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 So I like how they're shiny. Hold on there. Yeah. No. But then I wear the one that I wear the one that I wear. Yeah, mommy. Get a cake. Yeah. Oh, you don't. Oh, that goes too. Yeah, yeah. But when I walk on them, I don't place them. Yes, ma'am. Older, but like they stay. Me now. Oh, yeah. This is one because you said that the other ones would be what? It's just they look more narrow. They they look more. Yeah. Uh, hi, well, yeah. He looks wider hi. for some reason. That's why I thought he was going to be bigger. Jesus! Jesus. 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 You gotta use all the muscles. Damn, girl. Oh. <laughs> I'm not going to wear them to work. I'm only going to wear them to work. Please don't wear them to work. Oh my gosh, you can wear them to work? Really? No. So I, th I told you you could throw away the wedges now. <laughs> Why wouldn't you want to wear them to work? I am. I'm gonna wear them to work for my first day of load, I mean. Guys, I uh, just got my car washed and she is smelling sexy, let me tell you. Um, I'm on my way to go get waxed, like you guys just saw. We celebrated my sister's birthday. Celebrated my sister's birthday and I'm so freaking excited I'm not gonna lift up my arms. So I'm on my way to go get my armpits waxed actually. Um, they're so hairy right now, guys. Like, oh my god, they're so hairy. So I made a quick appointment to go get waxed. I feel like the fuck. I hate when my seat just doesn't adjust to me. Like, who's driving my car? <laughs> Poor lady poor lady i actually have to get the info so for those of you guys who do not know a couple of not days a couple of weeks ago we had someone crash into our neighbor's house and then they crashed into our fence so we live on a very busy street and we actually just got a bunch of like speed bumps added to our road which I'm not gonna lie, when we first purchased the house, that was like a big, big, big downfall for me. But because the house was so far away from the street, I didn't think it was gonna be that much of a problem for us. And it hasn't really been a problem, like like crazy or anything. You know, the kids, they always have like an area to play in, but we always have to make sure that the gate is closed. Like we can never have the gate open because like if the kids were to run off, they would literally run off to a main busy street. And on top of that, cars drive through here like they're in a fucking hurry. Like they drive, the speed limit is 25. We're in a neighborhood, okay? And there's literally speed bumps, there's signs. <gasps> fucking 
garbage trucks just threw hella fucking dust at my car and I just got my car washed. Motherfucker. <laughs> Ugh, little bitch. <laughs> I've had two people crash into our house, okay? And that's very dangerous because like sometimes I think and I'm like, imagine like we're pulling out or we're like pulling in to our driveway and then somebody just fucking comes and like rams us and then like we're dead, you know? But the way that my house is at the corner there's like a turn and it's a very sharp turn like if you're coming fast you're gonna miss the turn and um she was coming really really hard and she hit our our trash can i mean our mailbox and then when she hit the mailbox her whole side of her door came off i'm pretty sure i've told you guys this before i'm not sure if i mentioned it on here or not but basically her whole door came off i don't even know how the girls were okay um but that happened and after that happened, I am, I can't even tell you guys my story because this freaking trash can is just dumping a bunch of trash on me. Okay, I'm gonna stay here. And this freaking guy in the back room might even honk at me. I didn't give my distance. <laughs> Cars were really, really, really bad. So I was on vacation during this time, so I didn't even know what was really happening. Yvette was watching my house, um, so she kind of like let me know. But then when I got back home, I saw the damage and our mailbox got fucked up. We still haven't even fixed it. We never even reached out to the girl or anything. Like we didn't file any claims or anything like that. We call did a police report and we tried to run it through our insurance. But because we were going to get our fence replaced anyways, we just figured it would just kind of like add an extra cost. But she should have definitely paid for my mailbox. So then this person this next person um they okay so the way that they hit my house it was like at a corner where our light pole was at and our fence was at and then they took my whole neighbor's freaking fence guys like it was so bad and my neighbor is an old lady like my neighbor is like 80 years old she's like a l little old lady i think she lives by herself i don't even know like maybe with her husband i don't know i always see her and she's just this little old lady and i remember the biggest bang happening and oh my god my camera's gonna die one second my back yes okay so the second person sorry my camera died so the second person that crashed into her house we heard this loud ass bang and it was me and Lisa's and the kids and i just remember the bang happening and then me looking at Lisa's, like we both woke up and if it woke up with Lisa's, you know that shit was loud because Lisa's can have a rain a freaking train like running through him and he still wouldn't notice oh my god i'm stupid wait am i going the right way no i'm going the wrong way so yeah so we heard the biggest loud like bang and you know that if it woke up Lisa's, it was a really bad bang so um the light kind of like 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 se relampago and then it went out so this freaking guy knocked out all of our power from our whole house literally knocked out all of the power and um i was just like what the fuck happened so we woke up and then we hear like the sirens we hear um, and then it felt like two bangs kind of happened back to back so i don't know if like they he hit our car i mean our house and then like that was bang one and then when he hit the ladies our neighbor's fence that was like bang number two um but it sounded like two loud ass bangs so the mean Lisa's immediately like we get up we go and we figure out like what's happening we go outside and then we see like the fire department start getting there like the fire department we live down the street from the fire department like the fire department is like five blocks away from our house so they got there super fast we go outside and Lisa's is like oh it looks like somebody crashed blah 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 so then all night they were working on getting like our power back on long story short the guy fucking took down our main power line and then the city of Los Angeles decides that we do not qualify for them to cover it when it's like a city pole like it's not our electricity it's literally the city pole outside and they said that they weren't going to cover it that they were not going to cover our light and that we needed to figure it out i'm like honestly no fucking lie no lie since i've moved out here in la to la like they don't give a fuck about their i don't know if it's the area that i live that they think like we just work to pay or what the fuck but they charge for everything and they don't want to help for nothing it's like how do you not pay for a light pole that is for the city of la right makes no sense so then i call um my my like our our actual like electrician and we call him and i'm like hey um i wanted to see if you can let us know how much it would cost us to get 
our power working. So basically we had like temporary power. Um, I'm gonna have to park far. We had like temporary power. And then the guy says, yeah, I'll let you know how much it's gonna cost you guys. I'll give you a quote. We're like, okay. You guys know how much this fucking guy said, well not even the guy, it's not his fault. <laughs> like, it's the fact that it's this much work. Because I love our electrician, he's legit. He told us it was gonna cost us $29,000 to fix our line. <laughs> Excuse me? I mean, thank God we have insurance. But I'm like, what the fuck do you guys mean? It's gonna cost me $29,000. Everything is so expensive, guys. If I end up, like, leaving here <laughs> and selling everything, you guys know why. It's because, like, I'm barely surviving. I'm barely surviving out here because everything's so expensive. But I'm not even kidding. Como me el dinero se me va. Puros pinches billes. All day. Bill, 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 bill. No joke. So $29,000 is our tab. And I'm like, oh my god. So at least is what are we going to do? So I've been meaning to talk to the old lady because she has the guy's license plate. And he, apparently, he's an attorney. And he was drunk driving. I don't know what the old lady's gonna do for her fence. She said she didn't want to get involved with him because she knows that he has power because he's an attorney. She pisses me off. That she has power. I'm like, we can sue this guy. It sounds like a headache, to be honest with you guys. I feel like that's what sucks, that sometimes you don't even want to deal with it. But I'm just like... I'm not gonna charge $29,000 to my insurance. Like, my freaking deductible is probably gonna be super high for the house. And, like, it's just like drama and like unnecessary things. And, like, sometimes I miss renting because, like, you don't gotta worry about nothing. When you own a house, it's so different. Like, everything's up to you. Everything is your responsibility. You have to pay for everything, <laughs> you have to take care of everything. And I'm just driving around making U turns and shit. And I'm about to, like, be late to my appointment. But yeah, that's my little life update. So that's what's going on. What happened to my neighbor? What happened to us? Like I said, this is the second freaking time that this happens that somebody drives into our freaking house and crashes it. So yeah, other than that, our weekend was great. I had a really good time with my sister celebrating her for her birthday. Um and y'all i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog i'm gonna get my armpits waxed i'll show you guys once my armpits are waxed how cute they are you know what i'm just gonna do some illegal shit i'm gonna do some illegal shit i'm gonna park where it says don't park i'm gonna get up and do my armpits and if i get a ticket well it is what it is as long as i don't get towed King gas fucking car in the middle of a no parking zone my armpits shouldn't take that long. And there's a car, there's an Acura in front of me. I guess we're both being illegal right now. Fuck it. I'm just gonna do it. I'll let you guys know right now if I get totaled. I mean, if I get towed. Bear me. Okay, guys, I didn't get totaled. I mean, towed. <laughs> I ran in there to get my armpits wax. It looks so pretty. Beautiful. Okay, what the fuck? I'm gonna take my emergency lights. That freaking Acura in front of me came in clutch because it didn't look like it was just me chilling here, but both of us. Whew, I hate when I lay down too. Uh, do you guys are like me? Like, if you're laying down for a long period of time, like, you get kind of lightheaded? Well, that's me. Excuse me. Thank you guys all so much for watching today's video. Stay tuned for my next vlog. And I'll see you guys on my next one. Love you guys. Throw it off of the ground tonight. The way you look at me just like I'm yours. Yeah. I never 
never felt like this before You make me feel the way I ain't feel in a minute I feel like I'm living when I'm looking at you, baby Never felt like this before 